Hi there, good Thursday morning. Happy Thanksgiving, happy Hanukkah. Hope your day's going along nicely, filled with family, friends, a fire, plenty of food headed your way, and some football as well. Uh, another January-like January day headed our way today. The clouds are going to stick around. Uh, we have, in addition, seen some light snow showers, not enough to mess any roadways up. Not that you want to travel today, but uh, it's going to be another chilly day with clouds hanging tough. If there's any good news, it's that the winds have finally diminished. Yeah, it's been windy since last weekend. We saw gusts to 30 with a high of 30 yesterday. Yeah, wind chills, lower teens yesterday. No wind chill today. The winds are going to be light. We'll get rid of these snow showers this morning. Now, the clouds are going to hang tough, and it's going to be another cold day with highs near 30 degrees. But uh, there are signs that things will moderate in to the holiday weekend. Black Friday looking cold as well. So the cool air in place, that is for sure. Temperatures 10, 15 degrees below normal and the deep chill extends all the way down to the Gulf Coast where they actually have freeze warnings out. The citrus growers are not liking that. And yesterday, for the third time in recorded weather history in the month of November in Atlanta, they saw measurable snow, four tenths of an inch there. So the chill for the entire eastern half of the nation is going to stick around today and tomorrow, and then we'll start to get a little bit milder into the holiday weekend. For today, get rid of the snow showers this morning. Uh, the clouds are going to hang tough through most of the day. Could see some late afternoon partial clearing, but all in all, just kind of a cold day, but at least not windy. We'll see highs near 30 degrees this afternoon, normal high 43. We're cold again overnight. We'll see some partial clearing out there going partly cloudy by dawn on your Friday morning. Black Friday, a lot of folks heading to the stores early. We're going to be down around 20 degrees for an overnight low here in the Glass City. And Friday throughout the day will be another chilly one and we'll see winds pick up a little bit as well. High temperatures, lower 30s. Now we've got a bit of a game going on up in Ann Arbor as we get into the day Saturday. It doesn't look bad. Uh, we're talking partly cloudy skies at the big house. Of course, Buckeyes, Wolverines going at it once again. Game time temps under partly cloudy skies. She has some sunshine. A bit of a breeze will be in the low and mid 30s. So bundle up, but all in all, not bad for the big rivalry, which continues here in Toledo. Mid 30s for highs under partly cloudy skies. She has some sunshine on Saturday. We're warmer Sunday, but we've got more clouds around. So your forecast shaping up like this. A January-like day on tap with clouds hanging tough. We'll get rid of the snow showers this morning without any uh, casualties. Just some pretty flakes out there early in the morning and uh, a high of 30 with light breezes for a change this afternoon. Overnight, we'll go partly cloudy. We'll see plenty of sunshine on your Friday. Filtered by high clouds from time to time, but a chilly black Friday indeed. You're going to want to layer it up. You're going to want to wear your gloves, your mittens, your hats off to the mall on Friday. A little milder Saturday. 36 the high, some sunshine, more clouds Sunday, up to 40. And uh, next week, we're looking milder until the end of the week. Right now, the medium-range forecast models have a bruiser of a storm headed our way towards the end of next week. Stay tuned on that. And, uh, yeah, stay in front of the fireplace today. Enjoy a second helping, the fire, some football, and make it a great Thanksgiving. Make it a great Hanukkah as well. Thanks a lot for joining us for your web forecast. Happy Thanksgiving. I'm meteorologist John James.